Space exploration in 2025 is poised for a thrilling year with groundbreaking missions and cutting-edge technology on the horizon. What can we expect from this new era of discovery? Let's take a look at the most exciting space missions coming up. As we look forward to the opportunities and challenges that 2025 will bring, the next chapter of lunar space exploration is poised to unfold. 2025 promises to be a year of remarkable activity in space with the launch of cutting-edge rockets and spacecraft. Here are some exciting missions that space enthusiasts can eagerly anticipate in the year ahead. And liftoff of Artemis 1, we rise together back to the moon and beyond. NASA's Artemis program with its powerful space launch system rocket is laying the groundwork for humanity's return to the moon. The race is on for companies to stay at the forefront of the lunar space race. Tokyo-based iSpace, which faced a setback in 2022, when its first attempt ended in a crash, is preparing for a second launch. Intuitive Machines, a US-based private space company, which successfully landed on the moon in 2024, will attempt a second mission to the lunar south pole, where they plan to use a NASA drill to analyze potential ice deposits. Meanwhile, another US-based company called Firefly Aerospace is all set to send a lunar lander to the moon this month. Elon Musk's SpaceX is continuing the development of its Starship rocket, which is designed for deep space missions. Starship's test flights in 2025 will be a key part of SpaceX's goal to refine the spacecraft's capabilities ahead of planned missions to the Moon, Mars, and beyond. Looking back, the Apollo missions continue to provide a benchmark for future space exploration, with the success of the Saturn V rocket still a significant milestone in human spaceflight history. That's one small step for man. One giant leap for NASA's Artemis program is working to build upon these historic achievements. However, a recent delay has meant the planned launch of Artemis II, a crewed flight around the moon, has been pushed from September 2025 to April 2026. Despite this shift, the Artemis program remains pivotal in preparing for a sustainable human presence on the moon. Astronauts aboard the International Space Station will continue conducting spacewalks and experiments in microgravity, which could tell us more about the effects of long-term space travel on the human body. Private space programs are also expanding, with initiatives like SpaceX's Polaris Dawn pushing the boundaries of human spaceflight. Commander Jared Isaac Min, now emerging Copy from... Review and test matrix one, watching from the nose cone. These missions aim to develop the technologies needed for extended space travel and habitation. The riskiest part of it is that you threw away your atmosphere and then you have to rebuild it after the mission. Um, you know, there is no airlock. I, I think like, you know, if, you, if there's micrometeorite contact, then it was one hell of an unlucky day. Um, I think really like, you know, from our perspective, there's been two years of preparation going into this. The majority of that time focused on this operation. So SpaceX does not take this lightly. Uh, they know they need EVA capability, the knowledge of the operations and the suit in order to fulfill their, their long-term dream of, um, of potentially populating another planet someday. Interestingly, Isaac Mann, a 41-year-old billionaire and founder of a credit card processing company who bought a series of space flights from Elon Musk's SpaceX and conducted the first private spacewalk was recently nominated by U.S. President-elect Donald Trump to lead NASA. As humanity pushes further into the cosmos, 2025 promises to be a year of milestones and breakthroughs, laying the groundwork for the next chapter in space exploration.